I used to always get confused between Cushing's syndrome and Cushing's disease. Now, the one thing that is the same between them is that you end up with the increased glucocorticoid level. Things like cortisol levels are too high, but the reasons for it happening is very different. So remember, normally, your pituitary gland releases ACTH, which causes your adrenals to pump out glucocorticoid. Now, in Cushing's disease, it's a very specific problem that's happening. You have a tumor in the pituitary, like an adenoma, for example, that's pumping out way too much ACTH. This then causes hyperplasia of the adrenal glands, which pumps out the excess glucocorticoid. So to treat Cushing's disease, you either attack the pituitary gland and operate and get rid of the cause up here, or you may need to go and operate down the adrenals itself. Now Cushing's syndrome pretty much is any other reason why you end up with increased levels of glucocorticoid in the body. Now it could be because someone's taking too much steroid medication or they've been on it for too long a period of time. It could be because someone has got adenomas on the adrenal glands that are causing this. Nothing to do with the pituitary, but just adenomas on the adrenal glands. It could be because there's another thing in the body that's causing too much ACTH, like a small cell lung carcinoma, for example, that's leading to increased levels of glucocorticoid. It's pretty much any other reason why you're getting increased levels of glucocorticoid that is not due to a pituitary tumor leading to increased ACTH levels. So the treatment of Cushing syndrome is very much dependent on why you're getting increased levels in glucocorticoid in the first place, so there's not one specific cause. So Cushing's disease is a pituitary tumor leading to too much ACTH, leading to adrenal hyperplasia and therefore increased levels. Cushing syndrome is increased levels due to pretty much any other reason that's going on in the body. Hope this helps. Can pass, will pass.